Stress is a stimulus resulting in an arousal or a response to a specific situation. There are three different types of stress, arousal, eustress, and stressors. Arousal is a state of readiness to perform that helps motivate the individuals. Eustress is the positive reaction to a performer to stress leading to optimal arousal. Stressors are the situation that causes a stressful response, such as competition, frustration, injury, or conflict. The level of arousal and the way in which we behave affects our motivation and therefore affect performance. There are two different types of arousal and performance theories, the Holes Drive Theory and the Inverted U Law. The Holes Drive Theory is the linear relationship between performance and arousal. At low levels of arousal, performance is low, and performance increases in line with an increase in arousal. Holes Drive Theory suggests that experienced athletes tend to perform better under pressure due to their superior skills and the use of stress management techniques. The inverted U law simply states that arousal improves performance up to an optimal point. Past this point, performance begins to decrease. Similar to stress, you also have to look at anxiety. There are three different types of anxiety. State anxiety, trait anxiety, and competitive anxiety. Anxiety is a negative reaction of a performer to stress, often leading to overarousal, an emotional state similar to fear associated with arousal and accompanied by feelings of nervousness and apprehension. State anxiety is the athlete's emotional state at any given time and varies from situation to situation. Athletes who have a high trait anxiety view more situations as more threatening than those with lower trait anxiety and so respond with a higher state anxiety. Competitive anxiety is specific to sport. See competitive situations as threatening. For this activity, I will have two subjects, a control subject and a treatment group. The control group will complete 15 practice trials, have a 5 minute rest, then follow with 5 retention trials. Following the control group, the treatment group will complete 7 practice trials, 5 stressor trials, have a 5 minute break, then follow with 5 retention trials. I chose to throw an object, my shoe, at the subject during the stress portion of the trial. I believe it to be a good distraction because while you are focused on throwing, you are attempting to pay attention to the other object, causing you to pay even more focus to the shot. Another common stressor could be pressure, which could include making a final shot to the game. Stress is both good and bad for an athlete. If you have little stress, you may not be concerned with the outcome of the game but having too much stress will cause you to overthink and ultimately make a mistake. 